this video we're going to talk about wheelchair travel. This is when you start your routine in the centre of the trainer, but during your workout you either travel to the left hand side of the trainer or to the right hand side of the trainer. When the trainer is sent from the factory, providing you follow the instructions correctly and set it up, the trainer should be square. You'll be able to tell if the trainer set up square because when you look at the rollers, the nuts on the outside of the rollers should line up, which means the trainer set up square. So if the trainer is set up square, what's the reason that you travel left or right during your workout? There's a few reasons. First thing it'll ask you to take your tyre pressure. If one tyre is at a different pressure to the other and there's a significant difference, this can cause you to travel left or right. The other reason is tyre wear. If you look at your tyres and they're both at the same tyre pressure, but one's got excessive wear, that can cause travel. The reason that you get excessive tyre wear is if you've got some distortion in your frame of your chair. I have to say we've put a lot of different chairs on our trainers and very few of those chairs run perfectly straight on the trainer. Not to worry, it's easy to correct. If you do find that you're travelling during your workout, the washers that we included when you unpack your trainers are there to correct this error. I'm going to get on the trainer now, which has been set up square, and see if my chair travels straight on the trainer. Okay, so now having set the trainer up to the instructions and shown you guys that the trainer was straight before I started, I'm now going to wheel on my chair and I know from experience this chair on a straight trainer will always travel to the right. And there you go, I've clearly travelled to the right. And just to prove the point, if I wheel backwards, I travel back to the centre of the trainer. So I'm going to show you now how to correct this problem. First thing you need to do is just wheel off the trainer. Okay, so we've established that this chair travels to the right. To correct that is quite simple. All we need to do is to move this left hand side of the trainer back slightly. To do that, simple, take the washers which are supplied with the unit and I want you to put one of the washers behind the spacer at the front on the left hand side and another washer behind the spacer at the back on the right hand side. So this is where you need to position the washers behind the thumb nuts and the spacer bar if your trainer is travelling to the right and then need to be on the opposite side if your trainer is travelling to the left. Okay, so you removed one of the thumb nuts for the back of the trainer. Wheel around the front of the trainer and remove the thumb nut from the front of the trainer on the opposite side. Having removed the thumb nut from the back of the strap, we now need to put the washer behind the strap. And replace the thumb nut. We then need to wheel around the front of the trainer and do exactly the same on the front of the trainer. I've inserted the two washers into the trainer now to compensate for my chair travelling to the right. If you look at the two nuts which are sticking out from the rollers, they're no longer in line and they're offset by a couple of millimetres. OK, 
Okay, so now I've inserted the washers to correct the travel on the trainer. Let's now just try pushing, see if it's fixed the problem. Having done that, you can see it's corrected the travel. Had it not corrected the travel, and I'm still moving to the right, all I'd do is exactly the same again, remove the thumb nuts and put an additional washer behind each thumb nut. So there's two washers behind there. Um, with very few circumstances do you need more than two washers, but if you did, there's additional washers in the pack that you can insert. To recap, this chair was travelling to the right and we've inserted the washers to stop it. Remember, some chairs will travel to the left. To correct that, it's exactly the same procedure, but as we said at the start of the video, you just put the washers on the opposite way around.